Hey guys, I'm Jared with Striker Boats, and we are here today with two of our brand new 2024 model LX line of boats. So this video is just gonna give you a, a little comparison to give you an idea of the different sizes of the boat. So um, for boat specific videos, guys, please visit the video page on these specific models. So the, the red boat to my left is our LX380, and then the smaller one over here right beside me is our LX320. We, are, uh, we have videos of both of these boats individually to really get into the characteristics and features of each of these models. But for now, um, one of the most common questions that people like to know is size variations between the boats. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get in the boat so you can see what I look like in the one and then I'm gonna get in the other one and you can have a look to see what I look like in there. And please leave any comments or suggestions you have underneath. We are gonna try to do this as much as possible moving forward just to give you guys at home a little bit better view of what we actually see. Sometimes we get it, it's hard to picture yourself in something the camera or without anything to give it any real reference so now this boat here the 320 this is a very 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 popular boat now this boat kind of ticks most of the boxes for one to four people um it is a very seaworthy boat i feel very confident taking this out just about anywhere is on the smaller side. Now, that can be a very good thing if I'm looking for small. Now, if I'm looking to go into bigger water, or I want lots of gear, or I want to be more comfortable, or I'm camping, or, there, or I'm using my boat as a really utilitarian boat, well, I this is not my first choice. For myself, I'm a 420 to 500 guy. I really enjoy having the extra room. I like the bigger tubes. I like sitting higher off the water. Um, all that being said, these boats and what they will offer you i mean it it's really it's at the end of the day it's it's personal preference and and what will work for you so of course all of these different sizes will fit into people's lives a different way so 320 personally i like to pair this with a 15 or even a 20 horsepower motor it is rated for a 15 so we'll leave it at that um, the new 9.9s, 15s, and 20 horsepowers are all the same motor. They're the same weight, they're the same displacement, they are just fueled differently. So there's a restrictor plate and the ECU are different on these motors and that is the only difference on these new outboards. So does 15 horsepower? Yes, that is what you should do. Um, I've put other motors on with great success. Do not do that. Winky face. <laughs> However, uh, with a 20, you know, if you put four people in the boat, it is nice to have the extra power. So guys, this is what I look like in this boat. Now, personally, now we have the, the keel inflated, so I'm gonna kind of come up there on the one side. Now, you know, th this is great. Like personally, I don't sit on the seat. Now, I left this seat up for a reason. I'm gonna show you why. Now, look at that. This is what I'm talking about, folks. This is more like I personally, I remove the front seat as well. Um, I like to have a wide open platform. I like to be able to move around. I like my dogs to be able to have freedom of choice in their boating life. And personally, I just like the open concept of what, now you can see when I get in here, you know, I, it does, it, it, it looks really big outside, but when you get in, you do, uh, I'm six foot, I'm 200 pounds for reference, or 220. I'm tillering here. You know, you can sit on either side, of course. So, you know, you're running the tiller, and yeah, so, you know, really, with my size, I'm gonna be running the tiller up here, and you know, there's, if I have somebody across from me, this is a great boat for two people. Um, now, how many people can you fit in here? Really, it's rated for five. That being said, I've had 10. Every single spot on this tube is a seat. You know, it's, it's really, at the end of the day, is, is personal preference of what you're using, using this boat for. Of course, please visit our video on these boats specifically, and I'm gonna walk through this boat and, and show you all the features. So this is great. This is a, a great boat, good size for two people, two to four. 
I'm coming over to the 380. This is the LX 380 in red. It's also offered in gray in our LX line. Now, getting in this boat, again, I'll go over to where I normally sit, and uh, it, it is a night and day difference. Now, of course, we're a 10 and a half foot boat to a 12 and a half foot boat. You're wider as well, so you're not just longer, but you're wider, and you really feel the difference uh, sitting in the boat. Like I'm, I still have a lot of boat left when I'm reaching out here. So this boat's rated for eight people and you could easily fit eight people in here and still be quite, I don't know if I'd use the word comfortable, but it's, but it's definitely possible. There's lots of room for crab traps or prawn traps, fishing gear, camping gear. This 380 is, pro I think I'd have to double check the numbers for 2023 but it is a top performer. It is right at the top of our list for most popular boats that we sell. Really, they all have their niche and for different reasons. Um, the Pro 470, Pro 500, you can't beat those. Those are by far the number one boats we sell. This in the LX line, I believe this is the number one boat that we carry um, and for good reason. It's still very manageable with two people. Uh, you get lots of room. There's a lot of value. There's a lot of things that you can do with this boat comfortably. It will handle any body of water with ease. Ocean, lakes, rivers, you name it, this boat will do it. So guys, I hope we've given you a little bit of insight to what it looks like to have somebody in the 380 versus the 320. Um, guys, please like and subscribe our channel and we look forward to providing more videos to you shortly.